Yeah, it makes preparation, I want to say, easier, but it's still fresh in our mind. We break down every game, strengths, think weaknesses, things to improve on after every game, and so that's still fresh in our mind. We kind of were able to recap that right away. So we were able to get the kind of the best of you know learning from this game and we can apply it directly to our next game. We don't have to wait another month or a couple weeks to what get was, back to work. What were some things you liked about the way you guys played uh, Saturday? I mean, they're a great team, so they're going to provide, present a lot of challenges in a lot of ways, both on offense and defense. But, you know, I think we showed different flashes that we could be both effective on offense and defense, and a lot of the mistakes we made were uncharacteristic of us and were fixable. So just being better off the ground, which is something we pride ourselves on, we know we can do better there. Limiting turnovers, you know, we're going to play fast, we're going to play aggressive, and that might lead to some turnovers. So we're not going to punish guys for turnovers, but we can clean that up. And I think a lot of these mistakes are correctable, and I think that gives us encouragement moving forward. Does that make it? Does that make Saturday's result more frustrating, but also going into Friday a little more confidence that it wasn't you were overmatched? It was some things that are not characteristic. Yeah, when you come to the University of Virginia, you know you're not going to be overmatched against anyone. We know they're a really, really good team, and you know they're going to be better on Friday as well. It's not just going to be us that's going to be better, uh, but it does in some ways give us confidence that we know we have things we can improve on to you know have a better outcome on Friday. Again, we don't expect them to play that again. They're going to improve. They're going to learn from their mistakes. So it's going to be another good game. But we definitely are encouraged by the fact that we can find def definitive ways to move forward and be better come Friday. This is going to sound like a weird question, but how important is the ACC tournament? I mean, you guys set your sights on national titles every year. This event hasn't been there for a while. W what is the motivation level for playing well or, or winning this event? Yeah, absolutely. Outside of Peyton, none of us have ever played an ACC tournament before. So this is a, a new experience for all of us. We're all really excited. You know, one of our goals this year is not just to win a national championship, but along the way to win an ACC championship. You know, we've kind of had a tough finish the year, but we're fortunate enough that we still have an opportunity to go compete for the AC Championship. All of our goals are still in front of us, so we're going to take advantage of this. It's not just the national championship. The first step is winning these next two games to capture the ACC.